welcome to the artist vlog today's gonna be a really interesting day i have the the randomest hot hodge podge hodge podge modge podge hodge podge of <laughs> tasks to do today art tasks i have some commissions to finish some pieces to resin i have a lot of content to work on and then i need to prep for a podcast that i'm filming tomorrow that i've done no research for <laughs> I just finished my coffee and it's 11 11. That seems like divine timing to me. Okay, so I absolutely must tell you about this beautiful Phoenix commission that I am obsessed with. Um, I'm so happy that I decided to film this vlog while I was working on it. Now knowing how much this piece resonates with me and how much I loved the process of making it, having it documented just, it, it gives that extra oomph for me. But yes, I loved it. I love that it's a circle canvas. I loved how flowy it felt and also just the symbolism of a Phoenix. It's fiery, it's transformative. And I felt that while I was making it. I loved it, it was so great. That's the one thing about commissions I just appreciate so much is the ideas people bring to you may be different than you would have thought of, but maybe they're so perfect for you and you just need somebody else's perspective to bring that to light. Also, shout out to Catnip in the background. I love her vlogs. I love watching art vlogs while I'm working and hers are some of my favorite. So good. I love any like looping smoke type patterns or painting hair or feathers. Even my more impatient moments while working on it, I think were less frustration and more just, I was so excited I couldn't paint fast enough. I don't know. <laughs> um, I've been working on this for several days and I think I'm finally at the point where I'm cool with putting the first resin coat on it. Um, but I don't know, I don't know. I don't know when to stop on most paintings. Um, I don't know. I think I'm gonna add the gold leaf on and that might make me feel like it's more done. Um, and then I can resin it. It is a multi-layer painting, so I'm gonna keep adding details. So it'll feel more, more complete as the resin layers accumulate. So we're gonna do that. And then probably also paint the sides gold. Wouldn't that look cool? I think so. Anyways, <laughs> I'm, about, I'm about done with this. I don't know. I'm like loving it. But I just want to get resin on it. I'm seriously so impatient. Like, my ADHD is showing so bad. Um, but my last update that I sent to her before I even added all these details, she absolutely loved it. So I feel pretty good. <laughs> um, let's do the gold leaf. And then I'll take photos and send it off to her and let her confirm that I can resin it and move on. I'm, I'm sure she'll love it. But I'm just being paranoid. It's the Virgo rising perfectionism. Gold leaf? I'm gonna get gold leaf everywhere. I'm gonna have to vacuum. Well, I needed to vacuum anyway, so whatever. It's fine. <laughs> this is the absolute grossest thing ever. Like, I just, it doesn't even close. <laughs> Okay, fine. <laughs> what I do is I just have a big pop-up table, one of the ones that I use for my vending events. I drag it up to my apartment and then we bust it open. Oh my God. And that's what we resin on. Okay, let's see if I can. So essentially I get a big pop-up table and then I put these black trash bags for like the outdoor trash. And uh, yeah, that's set up. These are reusable. The black trash bags so i just keep using them over and over and over again and it works great a, cu a couple of small small concerns is this painting in particular i'm a little concerned about it like the resin pulling in the center because of the type of canvas this is and sometimes resin will sink um so i had this genius idea i took a book that's like the perfect size and wrapped it in ziploc bags um so it has something to hold it up and hopefully 
that'll stop it from sagging in the middle we'll see and then this one set up this one's so thin honest to god guys i just put it on plastic cups and i i think that'll suffice i think that is good enough anyways i'm gonna go mix up my resin which i think is all of my resin it's all of it um i hope i don't run out of resin how you doing Much to my dismay, I have found out something horrible. Like, what the f mm. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so nice. <laughs> Hello. Hi! <laughs> Hello. Welcome to Learn Learn Tech. I'm so happy to be here. Wednesday was actually my boyfriend's birthday, so it was a very chill day. I did a lot of baking. We didn't really do anything that extroverted, um, but the rest of the week after that Thursday onward felt kind of like a watch, which is funny because it was a pretty hectic week. Um, we went to Schlitterbahn on Saturday and did an event on Sunday, and I filmed none of it because I just felt tired. But I think that worked out for the best because I got to just savor the experience, enjoy being out with my boyfriend during his birthday week. So it was nice. Uh, but other than that, I, four to six days later, like I did not film. I did not feel up to it. There's some clips here, like odd ones of me painting, working on a collection that I was cooking up, which you will see further on in the vlog. Uh, but yeah, not much was happening. Uh, and and I, my shipment of resin got delayed, so I just wasn't feeling it. Hello. Uh, welcome to... Friday, like the next week. Not a lot art oriented has been happening. I've been doing a lot of computer editing and cleaning. So the update for today is I think my resin just arrived. And yes, I do look like I just rolled out of bed. It's because I did. Um, I don't want to talk about that either. It's like, oh my God, ah, he tried to swipe in my coffee. Okay, I started editing this vlog yesterday. Like, I finally went through what footage I did get in and start editing. And I have so many clips of him just randomly being a menace. And by him, I mean Ozzy. What was my point? Oh my god. We're already in ADHD spiral. <laughs> Tomorrow, I'm throwing a pool party at my place. So I need to clean my entire apartment <laughs> so it can be habitable for people over. Um, and I also need to finish out a lot of work, resin all these commissions today. It's going to be... There's a lot going on. And hopefully at some point I will get better dressed than this. But you know, that's, sometimes I just have to start moving. I feel like maybe this is like the Virgo thing and it's a Virgo season. The sun has gone into Virgo. And something about Virgo energy and Virgo season, and I know this is being a Virgo rising sun in the sixth house, is it's really easy to nitpick yourself and not continue on things or not like do the little, like the editing, like the grunt work, the daily routine. Like you can get distracted from the things that make your life valuable because you're like nitpicking yourself to death. And it's like, the beauty is in the structure, it's in the routine, it's in getting up and going and like getting it moving. And then things kind of come together as you're in motion. So I don't know who needs to hear this, but I need to hear it. It'd be very easy for me like maybe a year ago to not film because I'm like, oh, my hair's not done, I look like a mess. But then like the entire day would pass me by catering to all my little criticisms and not getting anything done so i have to i feel like a lot of y'all also are going to be coming from my tiktok where y'all are used to my motivational rants and sometimes they just flow so i think that's going to be fun like a fun thing about having a vlog channel is i'm just living my life and randomly things will trigger me and be like you know what <laughs> anyways back to go get the resin we gotta we gotta go get that goddamn resin let's go good lord i cannot wait till it's not like 100 degrees every single damn day And I'm not a very patient person. New case. 
case of resin. Okay, opening up a new pack of resin. <sighs> yes. Yes. Oh my God, I'm so happy now. Yay. <laughs> Um, but that's been this week thus far. Yesterday, we are tired vibes. I'm still feeling very motivated, but for some reason, my energy just doesn't kick in until the evening. I've been working till like 2 a.m. because for some reason, like nobody's home until the afternoon. And then around six o'clock, that's when I want to go business owner mode and I can't explain it. So that's where I'm at. I'm drinking coffee. It's currently 1.30, which is on track for how things have currently been. I did get up earlier and I did work. So I did a ton of admin and like messaged people back and did like, like emails and shit. Like it wasn't, it wasn't that interesting. And then I took a break. Um, I need to ship out the Phoenix painting, which, all, which also means I need to take photos of it, like scans for prints in the future. And then I also need to actually pack it. So I'll probably film myself doing those things today. Um, along with everything else <laughs> and then I also managed to sell a couple of little mini originals to somebody local who's super cool so I need to go grab those out of my garage make sure they're like cleaned up sealed properly like do a last minute check on them because I believe they're going to pick them up on Friday which is good because I don't have to ship them out I love my local people I just gotta say when somebody local buys a painting and I don't have to worry about the mail I love it I love it anyways <laughs> You know who you are. I'm obsessed with you. So besides that, I think that's basically the vibe for today. It's just a ton of painting. Um, I'm not doing the best on time right now, but I'm just like going to like be out of sight, out of mind on that. <laughs>
Hi guys, it's Friday, bit of an update. Yesterday I dropped the new collection. It's amazing, I did sell a piece on launch day. I will have to, it's the one that I was working on. I did sell this piece. I'm super hyped about it. I do think I need to add another resin coat before I send it off. It's fine, I just, <laughs> this entire video, I feel like I'm just doing Virgo rising perfectionism and stuff where it's like, it's not good enough, I need to fix it, but it's fine. An update, I, I really should stop filming for this vlog and just get it edited and get it up, but here we are. Um, I ran out of time, <laughs> so I'm just like, I just keep filming. Like, I just keep filming more clips, I just keep adding more parts. It's giving a monthly vlog, which I think is what this might turn into, at least at the beginning while I get used to editing, because I'm not very good at editing yet, yet, um, is monthly vlogs. I'd love to do weekly vlogs, because I'm very ambitious, but um, we're going on week three now. <laughs> of filming this so i guess monthly vlog it is yesterday i dropped the new collection that's blue moon inspired you you can see a lot of the vibe right yes i have an event to go to i'm vending at a market in austin and i need to leave in an hour i'm ready i feel great but um none of my art is packed up time to go oh my god I was so assertive about every single individual piece being done and complete in time for this show that I stayed up till 4 a.m. painting. I am operating on very little sleep and two cups of coffee thus far, and I'm gonna be at a vendor event till 10 p.m. tonight. So I need to, I need to get on it. I need to get packed up. Let's go, let's go. Mm -hmm. gotta check it Yeah. I already have a clip of you in there. No way. Just your head. Oh, <laughs> like in the background of a clip. Ha, ha, ha. 